All right, coming up on our teepee here. Just doing some clicking kind of randomly. Yeah, a bunch of it has fallen down. Wow, a whole bunch of it's fallen down. Huh. Yeah, I'm going to see if that's naturally occurring or if it's been messed with. It's hard to move. All those sticks? Yeah, it's destroyed. All moved around. Yeah, the tarp is at the base of my artwork design there. This used to be all a very nice place. Yeah, go ahead. Go, please. I guess it's just all falling apart. I mean, the tarp, probably somebody found the tarp and unraveled it. It's a really pretty area, huh? Yeah. being that low. I thought we made it taller so we could, I mean, I guess that's how it is, I don't know. It's real pretty here though. You know, you have a little bit more shade and so everything's that much more green. It's just, you know, right across from the way. Should make your own little spot here with the access screen. Yeah, we kind of did with that. Yeah. Well, our friends don't want to make any noise anymore for us, so. Yeah, kind of pointless having this on. There's all kinds of little things falling around in the water. And It's like the leaves aren't even connected. I like that one. Well, yeah, it's pretty. Some kind of vine. I'm gonna take a fern and this one if I can. No, they don't ever really grow. It's a really pretty special place right here. Hang on a second.
definitely a human making maybe a, I don't know, talking or something. You're talking? Yeah, I don't know, like maybe someone was yelling at me. Oh, there's something. More than that. Just just do more. I like that sound. Oh. Not good. It's still smoking. Yeah, that's that's gotta be good. That was quite a bit. Okay. This little green car. It's here, he just moved it over there. So we'll see next time if anything happens with that. So that's definitely pretty interesting that it's placed on the log in the past, for sure. I'm sure some kid might find it in the Maybe. Oh, well, it could have started after we started hiking up there, and now yeah, at least it's true that we saw silver lining. Had the big umbrella. I was gonna grab it, but I didn't. So Greg has one hand. Well, I have two, just not a very good one on the right. Only the uh, only the use of. One because of shoulder surgery. Yeah, hopefully this will stop quick. I didn't. I don't know. It didn't look like. I don't know, maybe we just caught a small section there because it didn't look like it was going to be raining. You still in uh, pain with that? Yeah. Yeah, it will be for probably a while. Obviously not as bad as it as it was the first three four days, but yeah, each uh, each morning I wake up, it's pretty much starts over. And then of course once we do physical therapy, then that's gonna you know I'm, that's the joke everybody that I've ever talked to so far about it. They're like, yep. And then then the real pain's gonna start, and I'm like, mm, yeah, it's good. Other people will tell you, you know, physical therapy is not supposed to hurt, and then. Uh, Mm -hmm. And there are, you know, obviously limitations and ranges, and, you know, I can tell if, if it's not in the sling, just, you know, I can barely move it that that far, but it gets to a point where it's like, all right, and that's where they start bringing you past that point, and, uh, anyway, mm -hmm. we'll see. First appointment's tomorrow for physical therapy, so... Well, this is the, uh, month of June, so... Colorado. Colorado. So what we get is this. We get rain and storms and the thunder and uh, hail and it's actually pretty exciting but obviously not when you're trying to go hike and you've got everything ready. Because I can look at, like I just put one on the page. That's what gave me the idea. I can look at these shadows and everything that he's saying or stuff or that someone is saying is stuff. And I can highlight it and be like, yeah, no, that's not. That's a tree. That's a shadow. You know what I mean? And just kind of have fun with it. Not so much to be mean, but to be real. Right? Just to be real. Just to... Did I ever send you that thumbnail? Like, like, your, like your thing, truth seeker, you know? I don't know if I ever sent, sent that thumbnail. It uh, came up on one of my feeds and uh, saw the thumbnail, whatever. And it kind of reminded me of... Uh, like Guardians of the Galaxy group. <laughs> uh -huh. Like it basically just kind of has this just image to it, right? But it's it's out of focus. You know, you can't really see it that well, and whatnot. And, and, and clearly, yes, you can make whatever you want to out of that. It's a joke mm. we kind of had about clouds mm -hmm. in the sky. You know, you make right. what you what you want out of what you see. But uh, right. Anyway, so I, had, I took a screenshot of it. I don't remember if I sent that to you or not, but uh, I don't think, think so. Oh, well, let me see. That's the cloud 
that just went over us. It's going that way. So we, it's tough, that's hard to say. So that's the one that just rained on us. Another one might be coming, that's hard to know, but I, I guess, yeah. Well, don't know. This guy's got the right idea. <laughs> I need to put it over my backpack because I'll watch Sean. Yeah, that, that Osmo, I read the instructions, you know, I always like to read the stuff. It said, do not get it wet. Do not even think about getting it wet. I'm sure. So, it also said, keep it away from like dust and debris. So even when we're digging everything, I gotta like keep it in the case. Nope, that makes sense. Staying out there. See, so just doing this here. Yeah, this audio is ruined. Like, even if I'm like this, it's. I don't get it. It's terrible. You would you would think that even holding it in your hand here and not actually moving your fingers at all, you'd be fine. And it still does. It's like a magic trick. Hey, sunshine. Thanks. The sunshine is coming out. Trash. Come in where? What door. Checking some oh, sense. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> no one. You can have there. some. I'm trying to get some rain on the screen. This is actually waterproof. So. So I got the uh, video going. So try to hold your shovel, okay? Instead of banging it on the ground. I'm trying to get a good picture of that. I'm in. They're all over the place. But the colors are cool. Yeah. It's not easy. I mean, just hiking and holding stuff in general is just harder than it seems, you know? Especially if you're trying to film at the same time. Um, well, that's what I mean, trying to yeah. film and keep everything quiet. Nice. 
now we don't have any snow to contend with. Yeah. No cold. But now is the flip side of that, which is heat and sweating. Looking all around. And there we go. Is that one? No, that is not. Never mind. Some piece of trash or something. Great thunder. It's the second round. So we know they don't like these games with these jars apparently. So I'm gonna just dump these out. Let them roll all over the place because I'm filming. So I have one hand to work with. Okay, this one is really cool because this is actually inside a spray paint can. It's just insane. They put marbles inside spray paint cans. Definitely, I did not know that. It's really pretty, like my favorite one. Okay, so there's those are. And uh, I don't have room in the backpack right now, so I'm just gonna leave these. I don't know, if we change it, we'll, uh, we'll see. We'll leave that like that for now. Kinda waiting for the second round of rain to come, so. Hopefully it doesn't, but we'll, we'll see. This is gonna be a one-handed attempt. I'm kinda of waiting for the second round of rain to come, so. Hopefully it doesn't, but we'll, we'll see. See how well we can zoom. It's just so much stuff to remember now. Like things hitting the backpack, you know, this thing and keeping it clean and how to use it and Yeah, I mean if you think about a production crew for instance, they've got you know, everybody's got their own little role, right? Yeah. That they have to remember, so we have to do we're it. essentially trying to remember all of that. Yep. Plus the yep. gifting stuff. Oh, yeah, I have. You're filming, right? Yeah. I've yeah. got gifts, so let's leave them. And I was actually going to ask you that when you talked about checking the gifts, if we had something to leave them. Yeah. Because usually that's, well. So can you film me okay? I'm going to go down. Uh, if you need me to be kind of there with you, um, I can try and do it from kind of where you're at. I'll just use the phone. I just more or less was trying to keep an eye on our youngster here. The youngster right there. Trying to keep everybody clean and happy. God, this sucks. I can't freaking hold this zoom on my shoulder. Something was definitely moving down here very loud. Uh, you know, obviously, that could be anything, animal, whatnot, but it's always worth uh, looking. See if we can capture anything. Something is definitely moving down here. Now. Get your apples. Apples and oranges. Maybe if you sing. I like to eat 
<laughs> apples and bananas. I like the big butts and I cannot lie. Oh. You other know, brothers can't deny. When a girl walks in with the itty bitty waist and the big thing in your face, you get sprung. I don't know if that's working. I don't, I don't think that's working. It's a... Uh, Sir Mix a lot. It's a song that you grew up with, yeah. Terrible, terrible song. There's, dude, if you actually go back and listen to the lyrics of a lot of the songs that we used to listen to, oh, I know. they're pretty it's bad, insane. and they're actually even worse it's now, I think. Clown but. Posse, dude, holy crap. That stuff's like completely... Yeah, just... Little by little, make it acceptable. It's fine, it's fine, nothing to see here, it's fine. You were exactly right, by the way, with the riots. Did you see the one Joe posted? The guy with the earpiece? I did not. So there's a guy there dressed up in civilian clothes, but he's got a wire in his ear. And it, someone got it, you know, an accident. He, so I already, know, I already knew they do this, but there's your proof. Mm. So they're, they're doing the riots on purpose. Of course. Of course. Was a big, huge scam. And why is that? And you know, why is that uh, not being talked about? By the way, why is that not a big issue with everybody being out there? If social distancing was so important, yeah. wouldn't we be going? You guys are going to infect so many people with this by doing that, right? That should be a huge thing. Yeah. But it's not because it's intended for exactly that distraction. So much, so much crap, dude. I just, I can't. I just, I hate them. You know, whoever they are that's controlling all this crap and doing all this stuff, I just hate them, man. I just hope they get confused. It works, and they know it works. I'm so mad at was. Maybe he's filming, so I'm not going to use it. I think Dustin's doing what I was doing before, which is mocking somebody. Shh. I mean, he's actually just trying to use what they do. Uh, maybe that's what we've been missing. You know, deception. It's not nice when you guys make fun of somebody else or talk bad about somebody. Stop. I would so love to hear him. What? <laughs> what? Would, would you though? <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, obviously that's that's why we're here. Um, I wouldn't. I don't, yeah, I'm sure that would Say be a little scary. Uh, you're going to have to tell me trying to look at the screen to see how this is going, but I think trying to stable this is almost impossible. In the sun, just make sure the sun's not, because it picks up the dots in the lens, they're microscopic. That's why I can't clean them. Yeah, I've definitely noticed that on some of the other videos. It yeah, sucks. Yeah, brand, brand new camera. I know. It, it, brand it's new just... out of the box. You clean the screen, and it's just microscopic things in the glass. It really does suck. <sighs> Yeah, that sucks, man, because I, obviously we don't hear anything now, but definitely something was down there. What? Don't know. Yeah. But you know, it's crazy, because you would think you'd keep hearing them, right? Yeah. Like, you hear it, something happens over one direction, you hear where it's leaving that area. And, uh, we haven't had that. It's just a noise and then nothing.
Hey, uh. Hey! I, I didn't. I didn't hear you. I don't hey. think. I don't think that was loud enough. <laughs> right? They're like, well, you guys are looking that way. Dun dun dun. The distraction worked. We're looking over there while they're stealing the apples and. <laughs> hey, those are my apples. No, ours are in the bag up there. Well, never mind. They can't steal what's being gifted, obviously. Yeah. Don't steal! Hold them for you. Oops. They failed. Yeah, there's been a lot of that going on this last week. Oh yeah. The riots? Mm-hmm. Why? <clears throat> yeah, I mean people don't realize what our crazy government is is up to and then they've been doing this, you know, all the way back into the seventies with the hippies. You know, people some some people are aware of this, but most don't know. The hippie was created. They were actually government officials that had this long hair, tie dye shirt, the bell bottoms the whole thing, and they went out to clubs, and they started this trend. This isn't a myth, this is a fact. You can do research and, and find the pieces of that. But like with these riots, they just, they're, everything is just, mm -hmm. so much crap going on, so much BS. If we could just get rid of them, you know what I mean? Get rid of these stupid elites. This yeah, I, I mean, I can only imagine if there weren't all these stupid agendas that were up all the time, yeah, just how great messing with society would be. Right, if we could just be normal people in a good world, solar power could run everything. I mean, nope. I guess it just all comes down to greed. Because that's... Without money, you don't have power, and you don't, you know, get even sexual favors. I mean, you can take it however you want. It's all, it all comes back to greed, you know? Oh, yeah. Could you imagine how it would be, though, if we were all on the same that's, level? That's what I'm fin saying. Financially, all of it. Yeah. All on the same level. Then well, I don't know about financially, because now you're, it's kind of like communism, but... I mean, you should be able to work as hard as you want and, you know, get what you want. Well, yeah, obviously, it's, it's, it's got to be based off of something. You can't just be rewarded for doing nothing and not putting in effort and not, you yeah. know, working your butt off. Clearly, obviously. You but... You shouldn't have these billionaires that are manipulating everybody and... Stealing. Fraud. Scams. You know? Making viruses. Even before COVID, uh, Bill Gates and a bunch of other crazy demonized a-holes... We're making viruses, um, I think it was in India, to, giving it to all these women, like 60,000 women, so that they were sterile, they could never have babies. But they, what they were doing was saying it's, you know, this is a vitamin or I don't know what it was exactly, there was some illness, this is a shot that's going to fix you. And it made them all sterile, so they're just trying to control population, which we have a whole discussion about that. But. And it's funny, some people will be like, Illuminati's not real, Sink in that way is not healthy. Dude, you can literally go to like Illuminati.org and they will literally tell you about their <laughs> events and some of the members and, you know, a bunch of stuff that isn't secret. Like, <laughs> it's like saying the DMV's not real. Okay, well, I was just there, so I'm uh, glad you think that. All right. Yep, all the crap that they produce and everything they do to society, it's literally for coming between people and, you know, some people are so passionate about things that they really just, if they only knew, you know, if they would even just open their mind to uh, the possibilities, then things would be so much better in this world, but that's just not how it is. People get passionate about stuff, they get told more or less how to think, and they become unreasonable. And you can't have discussions with people like that. 
especially when they label you as a racist or a bigot or, you know, xenophobe or whatever. Yeah, that's all there for, for a reason. I really wish we could all just stop with that crap, not let it interfere with us. Wish everybody knew so that they could see past all the BS. All right, opted for a little higher location. Right down here. But I wanted to uh, just get a different angle, different view. Straight across here, we've actually had some pretty interesting interactions. Uh, this is actually, like straight across is where we had had uh, what sounded like, you know, if a buddy comes up behind you and sneaks up on you real fast, you know, they you hear their footprints, blah, 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 blah. And, you know, so you, you turn, obviously, because that's just natural reaction. You know, what is it? What am I hearing? So we had that happen, uh, both of us. But we were opposite sides of each other. You know, he was further down the hill. I was uh, more up top and further one direction there. And both heard the exact same thing at the exact same time. Both turned and thought it was the other person. But when we both turned, of course, nothing was there. So, anyway, that's one example. And then I uh, had a deer that we were following that, well, that we saw and came across. And we decided it wanted to come booking down the hill real fast. And then it was shortly after that that we had the, uh, you know, the footprints behind us and the sound of that. So, anyway, um, and then of course the uh, first nighttime investigation uh, kind of takes place on that side. So yeah, I think that's uh, that's why we've had some things happen on that side. Is that's just where it all seems to come from. Right arm is in a sling, so I'm sorry, you're probably going to have some shake. I can't really control that. Can't really see. It's right behind this tree.
stupid rocks. All right, trying to keep everybody clean and happy. So there's that, here's some stuff we brought. I wasn't gonna leave all of them. I mean, maybe if they did something cool for us, but they have not done anything. Well, I mean, we do got those two quartz rocks that, yeah, but there's nothing this time. So probably not gonna leave all the apples. About bringing, you know, food or whatever. I can't remember exactly what they were talking about, but it had to do with like a, a pot roast or something of that nature. You know, some some meat is something that they would really like. You leave something like that out here, you know how many animals are going to be trying to yeah, get to it? Yeah, absolutely. That's why we have the box, and, and a bear already got into that one time. So, yeah. Might as well check if anything is under this. I think they really loved corn. Yeah, I mean, that seemed to be, I mean, I know you kind of wavered on that a little bit because it seemed like sometimes it wasn't being tasty, but that seemed to be the consistent thing that was always messed with or eaten or gone. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna leave these, keeping these two because I don't have stickers. Yeah, some down with the bag. We're gonna leave these three that have the stickers. The marbles sitting out. I guess I will take the jars back and then I'll take this back. That should be pretty straightforward idea, I think. Have to wrap these up so they're not clinging around. That's what we're gonna do. Okay, I'm setting up the tarp. Great, because something's definitely moving down here. Yeah, yeah, come with me. You hold this. Okay, thank you. Oh gosh. Come get your apples. Apples and oranges. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. I like big butts and I cannot lie. Oh. It's a mix a lot. It's a song that we grew up with, yeah. Terrible, terrible song. There's, dude, if you actually go back and listen to the lyrics of a lot of the songs that we used to listen to, oh, I know. they're pretty it's bad. It's insane. Actually even... You're exactly right, by the way, with the riots. Did you see the one Joe posted of the guy with the earpiece? I did not. So there's a guy there dressed up in civilian clothes, but he's got a wire in his ear. And it someone got it, you know, an accident. He so I already know I already knew they do this, but there's your proof. So they're they're doing the riots on purpose to distract you from the fact that COVID was a bank. So much so much crap, dude. I just I can't I just I hate them. You know, whoever they are that's controlling all this crap and doing all this stuff, I just hate them, man. I just hope they get what they deserve. I'm sitting on the same rock I was with the bluff charge. Greg is filming, so I'm gonna turn this one off. That actually gets better audio anyway, so. All right, just keep that one going. Oh, wait, look guys, look at that. Do you 
see that hole in the tree? You see the hole right there? My name is Colorado Big Paradolia. That's, that's the hole of Bigfoot right there. Do you see it? Oh my gosh. Blending into the tree. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's actually a really good idea, dude. Because they're probably most likely going to take the apples. So now will they not take it because of that? Or will they move that somewhere? That, that could be really cool. Let's find out. Okay, well, whatever was down there moving is... I don't know. GoPro's still up here filming. Or they could have shut it down like to do with everything, but... I left it up here filming. Okay, I just turned this back on. It just turned itself off for some awesome reason. So I'm done with the GoPro pretty much filming because the audio gets ruined, but I figure I can use it setting it places and not touching the thing. And so that's what I'm gonna do right now. Um, yeah, let me just put it up on this rock, I guess. Okay, let's see, maybe. Because we know the audio is good. So if we get knocking or something, we have this going. No, oh, yeah, I think it's good. To, obviously, for editing, it sucks having that, but more is essentially better. Yeah. Pictures. Oh, it is. Whatever. Yeah, because I can always go back. I can make a cool video, and then I can always go back to footage that I didn't have time to see, and you know, it's always there. So I've got the space. Well, what, yeah. What was uh, I was gonna say though is uh, you know, one of the one of the commenters, and, and he's. He said a few things before, and uh, he wanted to have you know direct communication through email. I just never had one set up to really do that, because you know, I don't necessarily need to be having all these people sending messenger stuff and Facebook stuff and you know whatever. Like I try to keep my personal life personal, right? So I went to set up the uh, the account for that so that I can have correspondence with people about any questions or anything they want to talk about. Mm -hmm. um, but one individual, he. He was talking about the trail cam and how you know we, we basically need to have gloves on and, and you know, various other reasons why they don't work. Which you know we've already thought about the camouflage, we've already thought about you know our scent and you know we've tried different things here there and whatnot. Um, but trail cams just don't work. What they seem to not know about that is every time we put it up, nothing's there. Yeah. Yes, it's, it's recording when we leave. We it's know it, yeah. and then we get done, and nothing no. gets recorded. It's insane. Same with the audio recorders. Yep. So they, shut they them, don't. They yeah. shut them down. So it doesn't matter what we do. <laughs> it's no. not gonna work. That's exactly right. I mean, <laughs> that's what I've said. It's like, it doesn't matter, man. They they just shut the things down. So don't even try anymore. But uh, you know, yes, thank you to the commenters for obviously you know giving their input about certain things. Um, and you know, unless they've watched every one of them and kept track of all of it. Uh, Clearly, they're not going to remember what we've done, what we haven't done. But, uh, you know, for, for not doing something that you suggested, that's, there's a reason. Right. You know, we've already done it, we've already tried it, or, you know, whatever. But, yeah, yeah. Or we just know it's not going to work. And we'll still do some things that we don't think are going to work just to uh, appease people. And, well, right, yeah. It's but it's like, just... Oh, show up, we're not going to do it. Right. Yeah, but yes. It just depends what it is. The trail cam thing is a complete waste of time, though. But, uh, yeah, dude, just film as much as you want on that. Yeah, and I'm trying to, I mean, obviously in this one spot, this is all I can get is what's in front of me. So I'm trying. Or if you want, just move that somewhere too, you know? You just put it in different places. Because, yeah, obviously running around hiking trying to film is not going to work with one, one arm. No. Um, so I'll, I'll kind of keep an eye on some, you know, maybe some different angles that we haven't tried yet. Uh. Obviously, with this, we want to get in some zoom-in shots. Yes, absolutely.
Candace West. Get a chance. Is twenty one twelve. Difficult terrain to maneuver with one shoulder, and then of course with my only good arm <laughs> holding this GoPro. Do what now? It breaks them up on its own. Okay. Proving more difficult than it needs to be. Uh, not, I just didn't want it to fall in that one spot. I can see it falling forward and what's that? Find a spot on this tree so I could get a cool, you know, whatever, like through the tree. Of the clouds, but you have to set them down though. Just don't don't have a good spot to put it. You need at least fifteen minutes. And actually that's right into the no, I look at it, it's right in the sun anyway. So that might not work. Okay. Alright. Oh well, it's amazing. It really is. It's a phenomenon. See, and that's not going to work because that's going to be right in the sun, would be my guess. The sun's right there. Let me see. This might work. I can't see the screen, so I have no idea what this is going to look like. And actually, all you're probably getting is the tree with the sun. And this leaf's probably in the way. Cool. Okay, so that's what we're going to go for there. Hopefully that turns out decent. That is just awesome, dude. I love that so much. Um, the bad thing is, deer, you know, they like to eat. So I don't know, to have a way to protect them. That is just so freaking cool, dude. I never would have ever thought you could even do that. I mean, you know, I've been trying to grow apple seeds at my house. Look, there's something here too growing. Look at that. This is another seed of something. <laughs> that is just amazing. This is another seed because that's one like I took home. They all died, all those, mm -hmm. which is fine because it, we, there's like four or five. And you know, the amount that are up here must be like 20. So we've got two little trees right there. And then you've got this little one right here, whatever that is growing. That makes me happy. This might be another one here. This looks like another one right here. Yeah. And this is quartz up here too. I'm going to that spot. I need like smoky quartz. Yeah, you just never know. I mean, if we, here's, look at this whole rock is iron. I don't like clear quartz, it's not nice. This is all iron. And the quartz. So yeah, this is a good... This is potentially good all in here. But just don't, yeah, make sure you don't cut your fingers. All in here. All in here. Should have gloves on.
only two food folders. Now I just need, I'll just get it out. Maybe some fans too. And that's the beautiful thing. What? You never know what's under where you're at. Could be the very next shovel full, you can come across yeah. something amazing. That hematite mm -hmm. rock I gave you? Mm hmm. I mean, yeah, the uh, well, dude, I was saying, I was saying at the time that was just amazing the fact that here. that just sits there. What I was gonna, can you stop a second? Yeah. What I was gonna say is that could have easily been gold. You know what I mean? That's how people find a lump of gold. Look at this, I don't know what this is. Wow. It's just right under the door. Because it could be quartz. Yeah, it could be quartz. I think it is. Unless someone's melting glass here. You see that? Yeah. Yeah, and that's actually the stuff I get excited about when I see it. Yeah. Yes. Funny, it's not even what we were digging at. I don't, I don't know what that is, but that is something. Stay tuned to find out. Yay! Let's see what we got. He was excited. I missed the very beginning portion of his excitement, but uh, you can see he's still excited about that piece. I was going to say, I don't remember hearing anything. Yep, going to have a little bit of effort. And get through some of the uh, not-so-fun parts to the rewards. Okay, trying to make my way back up here, one-armed. Where is it? There you go. I got a bunch of iron here though. And like these little cavities. So I've got tiny little openings. And that's always exciting, but you never know. It probably came from right there. Your mom found a nice a nice one right in front of you. Right there. So when we're done today, we're gonna go ahead and fill this uh, dangerous hole in, right? Yeah. yeah. And then we're gonna, then we're gonna unbury it again the next day. Yeah, and, yeah. makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Everything is harder when you're on a hill. Hear that pigeon or an owl? It's actually pretty beautiful weather. I don't think it's going to be too bad right now because that's what it looks like. It's always amazing how you can have clear skies like that and sunny and you're still getting raindrops. Yeah. 
cool. You're okay. You're okay. You can go. Thank you. So like a child, I started playing with all this iron. And now I gotta wash it off because it's gonna get all over everything. It's on my phone. I don't have any on my face, do I? Huh? I wonder what I'm saying to him. Be cool if we could see it. If it's an owl. Like. Oh. Ones that I've seen, they go right on the top of the trees. But yeah, I gotta get myself cleaned up here. Yeah. Got free makeup. Come on, free I know. Makeup. I'll stay on for. You need to wash your phone case when you're done. I know it's getting all over everything. I'm gonna clean it up. Wow. Ah, uh, your phone case. So we're gonna try and clean this guy up a little bit. Of course we've got that, uh, that iron all over it. Doesn't seem to come off uh, very well. Well, I couldn't tell if that was going on the quartz or what. I think that piece was already broke off. Yeah, see, this is just coming apart now. Oh, there you go now. Quartz? Uh, yeah. Almost got a little bit of smoky, it looks like, though. Yeah, it's really dark. But. As I'm cleaning this, this is breaking apart. So uh, I don't know if it was fractured while you were getting it out or. No, I got it out pretty clean, but it. Huh. Yeah, because I'm not. It's not like I'm pressing at all. <laughs> so yeah, that sun. Back, dude. Sun comes out and boom, it's hot. The sun just came out. The sun came out. Dude. I'm waiting. Dude. I'm waiting for one of them one time to be like. Would you please be quiet? I'm trying to sunbathe over here. Yeah. <laughs> hey! One of these days. Hopefully not now. Someone's gonna come. What? 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 So is that cool? Yeah. Can you see an A1? I think G16 is like UFOs and aliens. <laughs> Well, did capture it for a little bit. There goes the uh, GoPro. What was it? SD card or the battery. But that should be good. That it was should have saved it. Hopefully, no, it was there. I imagine it automatically does that when it dies out. Let's see it. Come on. Come on out. Come on out. Can you put that on there? No, I just found it. Huh. Laying right here. Cool. Well, there's a brief little time where we could hear that, so hopefully it's on here. Spot. 
lot. It's all on your cheeks. I think that one's probably headed this way, right? I'll just go hike around a little bit anyway, I think. How much is it going to be on or not? That is, that is the Osmo. You can uh, you can set it down too, and it'll follow you. You know, if you like walk around it. Yeah, that's something I do. And it's got this button on here, so I can go up and down. And the whole time, it's you know stabilizing, you know, shaking and your your human muscles. And... I'm just gonna go up. And then right here on the side, you can zoom in and out. Really cool. Alright, well, we're gonna see if we can't find that creature that's making that noise. If it's an owl or a pigeon or or what, and uh I'm gonna leave the tarp for now. Right there, this one. Photoshop, Bigfoot. Yeah. Laying in a hammock, right there. Sure. Thumbnail, boom. That back in the bag. Freaking iron gets on everything, man. Gotta wipe that, wipe that off. But anyway, we'll see. Let's see what the footage is like. Well, I guess for you, you already have seen now, but yeah. Good time to go. It doesn't look like that. Over there. There's what we just got out of. So that was a, okay, now there's a fence. That was a good time to leave. Yeah, awesome. Hey guys, please remember to get this code out there to anybody and everybody that could possibly use it. Friends, tell friends, tell friends, tell friends, family members, everybody, coupon gurus. Maybe you guys can help me get this out to like coupon websites and saving blogs and, you know, Facebook pages, all that stuff. Please guys help me with this code. Get it out there. Thank you.